Taste of the Town on CBS News Miami is sponsored by Goya. If it's Goya, it has to be good. Visit Goya.com today. All right, time now for a new Taste of the Town and time for the annual Dine Out Lauderdale program. That's where participating restaurants throughout Broward offer price fixed three course meals for much less. Yeah, I always get jealous of Lisa when she does these amazing stories. So we're talking here today about Cow Bar and Grill. It's in Hollandale Beach. It's one of those restaurants. It's a new one and it features authentic Argentinian food in a unique space. Here's CBS News Miami's Lisa Petrillo with a Dine Out Lauderdale edition of Taste of the Town. We can hardly contain ourselves to tell you about the family-owned Cow Bar and Grill, the first ever container restaurant in Hollandale featuring two stories with dining inside and out. There are 10 40-foot long containers, all remodeled and recycled. Okay, so we wanted to do something sustainable, right, and that was going to be what better a choice than a container. Plus it's uh, right next to the railroad, so it's kind of a good feel. We get to act like we're moving cargo, we're in a container. It's got a we're great sitting vibe. Cow Bar and Grill serves up some of the most flavorful Argentine grill-inspired cuisine with many meats sizzling on this authentic wood-burning parrilla grill. And famous Argentinians are honored as well. You got yeah. the man himself, everyone's man talking himself. about Messi. Mr. Miami right now. We wanted to go and highlight all the great things in Argentina and right now, of course, in culture, is gonna be Messi. Yeah. yeah, so this is a great way to kind of pay homage. You have also other Argentinian classic icons in the second floor and in this first floor here. Cal is participating in this month's Dine Out Lauderdale program where Broward restaurants are offering three course price fix menus for $30 per person for lunch and 45 per person for dinner. Considering that we're new, we wanted to get more embedded into the actual community, and this is a great way to do it while during the summer when most people are traditionally trying to find something new anyways. A sampling of that menu includes these tango sliders for a lunch appetizer. They're topped with cheddar cheese and homemade aioli served with a side of chimichurri. Really like charred on the outside, which I love, that gives it a crunch. Nice little American cheese on top. Yes, that's true. Argentinian American beef in the middle. Argentinian beef in the middle. Excellent appetizer. I could also have two of these and make it a meal. The sliders are paired with a crispy Argentinian brier. Cheers. Cheers. The lunch entree is a fresh and fluffy, thick crusted Argentinian pizza. The dinner starter is hearty and indulgent as well. It's truffle fries, followed by a cow favorite entree, the Patagonian lamb shank, served with a side of smashed potatoes. It'll, it'll fall right off the bone, by the way. Okay. It'll fall right I'll off be the bone. judge yeah, of that. Yeah, marinate it 24 hours, uh -huh. then we sous vide it and finish it off in our broiler as well. It did fall off the bone. So the biggest thing is sometimes these pieces of meat are under salted. Argentinians know how to flavor their meat. And finally, dessert churros dipped in a dolce de leche or caramel sauce. Crispy, crunchy, sweets for the sweet. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. I love it. We are far from done, Dylan, but tell everybody how many days you're open. We're open seven days a week for lunch and dinner. All right, and Dine Out Lauderdale is on for the end of the month, right? It is through August. With a fantastic taste of the town here in Hollandale, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS News, Miami.